As you enter, you are surprised to hear the clamor of battle and the cries of the wounded. The tower is being attacked from the inside. open. A thick layer of dust covers the tunnel floor. Even worse than the choking dust is the stench wafting up from the pipes. Foul water from the leaking pipes covers the floor of this room. The rats down below pay the filth no mind. filthy steam tunnels, you find yourself in the grand office of Pirates roam the halls, searching for plunder. As the magical shields vanish, you feel the beneath mercenaries below cheer at your victory. sign of Captain Tew anywhere on the second floor. He must have escaped higher into the tower.
blood tide pirates stand over the prone bodies of the wounded, looting them down to their last copper coin. This door leads out to the very top of the tower. This must be the path. The tower's exterior teems with pirates, screaming for your blood. The infamous Crimson Moon, flagship of Captain Tew's fleet, fills the sky with menace. If you could destroy the airship, then the pirates would be stranded in the tower. doorway leads into the tower's uppermost chamber. You hear raised voices screaming about the loss of the airship. One voice overshadows them all. Captain Tew is making ready for his last bloody stand. As the crimson moon falls from the sky, burning, there is a scream of fury behind you. Captain Two has arrived. 